Restaurants in Saigon opened literally two days ago on the 28th of October. We're super excited. So it's Saturday night now and we're gonna have our first date night in a long time where we can go and eat in at the restaurant. Super excited, where are we going? We're gonna go to a nice restaurant called Brick and Barrel. It's in District 1. They do like burgers, pizzas, all that good stuff and it's really good value. Mm -hmm. So we're really excited to go there and it'll be on a rooftop, so outside. And another good thing is you have to have the green card to be able to go, which shows you're double vaccinated. So we've got that already. So yeah, come with us. Good, let's go enjoy a delicious date night meal. Yay, too long. All dressed up for the occasion. Haven't worn trousers in a long time. <laughs> let's go. Restaurant's back open. We just arrived, Brick and Barrel is above us. It's like a little tower block of restaurants. So we walk in and walk to the top, Brick and Barrel. We're a few minutes early, but I think we'll go up. We made a reservation because we figured it was going to be busy. Two days, restaurants have been open. I think it's going to be busy. <laughs> yeah, and everything looks so normal. And this is the first time I've been in District 1 in four months. I haven't left Saudi yet in four months. Yeah. <laughs> good, to be, good to be back or no? I mean, it's just as busy as ever. Have a look. Like nothing has changed. QR code for brick and barrel. You gotta call them. It says phone QR code. Keep going up. Brick and barrel. It's okay, stop for the Instagram. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Yeah. Thank you. Come on. We got in. Had to do a quick healthcare declaration, but now we're in. Yeah. Choosing what I want. Mm, check out the menus. The pizzas are really nice here. For the burger as well. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's great. Thank okay. you. Good? Thank you. Thank you. That was our order. What did you get again? I got mushroom pizza and we also shared um, fries, onion rings and drinks and you got... Pepperoni pizza as well. Apparently they can't serve alcoholic drinks but not that much of a big deal for us but... Yeah, yeah. maybe for some. Yeah. Maybe later. There's our uh, appetizer drink. Yeah. <laughs> mm. <laughs> She's so excited. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Wow. Some onion rings, medium fries, and two beautiful pizzas. And a beautiful girl. <laughs> <laughs> but mainly the pizzas. <laughs> Just kidding. Mmm, tastes like freedom. Mmm, yummy. So nice to be out. Well, good effort. Was it yummy? Really yummy. Mmm, super good. The we've, fries are gone. Yeah, we've got one massive and one tiny onion ring left, but that's it. Lewis, Emma. <laughs> Lewis, Emma. <laughs> Right, I think we're gonna doggy bag some of this up, aren't we? Yeah, doggy. <laughs> <laughs> doggy style, I mean, doggy, doggy bag. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Take your home in some doggy bags. There's Sunday lunch or Sunday breakfast, maybe. Breakfast? Mm. Ooh. We're in a pretty cool rooftop here for brick and barrel. Shame there's some construction on the other side, still banging away, but pretty cool rooftop. There's Swenson's not too far away. She's looking for dessert. But you didn't finish your pizza. I made room. Yeah, left room for dessert. Everything on the menu, only 545k. Think it's good value? Mayo. Yeah, 15k for the mayo, but still. <laughs> still very tasty. Thank you. And a little doggy box to go. Are we gonna stop and try and get some ice cream on the way home? Exciting! Let's go. It's 
is going to be a new Ritz Carlton fancy hotel right in the center of District 1. They're still doing construction on it right now, 9 p.m. Check out the bar. Yeah, it's a nice yeah, vibe in here. Air cons. Oh, there five air cons. Very nice. Wow. Oh, it's really nice. But you guys can't serve alcohol yet? Uh, no, not yet. We have not been given the okay, so. Very nice experience. Got some leftovers. Don't oh. fall down the stairs. Try not to die going down these stairs. Yeah. And we just had a little chat with the owner, a guy named James. He was nice. New subscriber on the channel because he wants to check out the food <laughs> vlog when we finish. So that was nice. And we got to see inside the bar, which was pretty cool. But anyway, really nice dinner, right? Yeah, now to go to Spencer. Yeah, let's go check out the ice cream. Yeah. So we tried to go to the ice cream place, but the guy said, no, it's already closed. It's about 8.45 and we closed at nine, so we couldn't do it. So we just came home, but we got a few leftovers. Did you have a nice date night? Yeah, it was so nice. Thank you. And thank you to James and Tyler, if you're watching this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Shout out to those guys. They were very nice, friendly, and they subscribe to the channel. They want to watch when the vlog comes out. Mm -hmm. Thought the food was really good. We're very yeah. happy to be out seeing restaurants again. I'm sure there'll be more restaurant reviews and food vlogs on the channel. So if you <laughs> like that, then uh, thumbs up, thumbs up, and subscribe, and you can stay tuned for the next ones. Yeah. In the meantime, if you want to see some other videos, you can check out uh, Apartment Hunting up here and some lockdown playlist or some other playlist down there. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> and see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.